The Merriam-Webster Dictionary defines doping as the use of a substance or technique to illegally improve athletic performance. The urge to do well and earn laurels perhaps forces sportspersons to use performance-enhancing drugs. Unfortunately, they don't realize that the very drugs can push them from the pinnacle of glory to the abyss of disgrace. And the latest to join the hall of shame are shot-putter Inderjit Singh and wrestler Narsingh Yadav, both selected for the Rio Olympics. Whether willingly or unwillingly done, a sportsperson caught in a doping scandal will have to bear the burden of guilt right through their life. Alarmingly, according to recent reports, 687 Indian athletes have been banned for doping-related incidents since 2009. India stands third in the drug hall of shame behind Russia and Italy. Perhaps the easy access and availability of drugs over the counter makes it all the more tempting for coaches and sportspersons to resort to illegal methods to achieve their goals. Some international sportspersons who have overcome the trauma of getting caught in the doping net have openly regretted their decisions and explained how they have suffered psychologically, physically, socially, emotionally and financially because of their mistake. In fact, there have been media reports of athletes using performance enhancing drugs with syringes and used drug disposables found at stadiums during major sporting events in India. Some medical experts too on condition of anonymity have claimed that some coaches and sportspersons have openly approached them for inducing performance enhancing drugs. Given that India is at the cusp of achieving sports glory, serious thought and action must be taken to ensure that this malice does not grow and spread. All stakeholders must address this issue with utmost urgency and one of the measures perhaps could be to ensure strict compliance on selling over-the-counter drugs.